That's quite a few of them. Now I'm going to back up into it and watch what happens. <laughs> that is unbelievable. Hey guys, this is Joe Tech from Joe Tech Tips. We're on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. And today we're going to be starting the Gamer Series once again. Um, I still have product reviews that I'll be doing. However, on the weekends... I'll be publishing gaming videos once again. So this is going to be ARC. No seasons, but this is going to be episode one of Extinct. This is a new map. Well, we're going to be playing a new map. It came out November 2nd. And for those who have not even known about it or didn't had no idea that it even came about... Uh, we're going to be playing it now. I've played it for some time. A couple hours or so. Probably a lot longer than that, but you know what I mean. So, we're going to play Extinct. I have the tech suit and everything like that to show you the map and explore so we don't ki get killed. We will be playing this game for real, but I wanted to show you the ins and outs of this game first. Now, I've obviously set up some some stuff here because I don't want to die I do have tech rifles here to protect the base that is here however this is one entrance of uh, <laughs> the area that I'm in and then it goes all the way across to the other side right this is a pretty big map I'm gonna show you the map itself okay there are two domes the tan that's here on the bottom right and then up top so the tan is the desert and the blue is the winter all right and there are three monoliths and there's one in each one of these so it tri triangulates and the other one is actually physically here so we're going to go straight up and just show you an aerial shot i do have a, a dragon a, way, a wyvern. That's actually a corrupted wyvern. And I'll explain to you momentarily. So this is the entrance. The, the landscaping is just unbelievable. Now we can't go past a certain height. We will die. So as you can see that goes right through. And there's one dome. And the other dome is over here. And these are going to be short 15 minute increments. So you can see. Map is tremendous. If I did this on foot it would take me forever. But I really want to show you this map. So what we're going to do is we're going to give you two quick views of the desert and the winter now this is unique this is like a hologram all right you can see it the barrier around the outside all right there's no barrier here so this is all open here and we can explore it's huge there's so many caverns and caves and all kinds of things here to explore it's not even funny but I want you to see something I'm gonna drop down and you're going to be blown away when I show you this. I'm dropping down for a reason. Hopefully I won't get killed. I hear something. I don't have a jetpack. Oh, you got to be kidding me. How the hell did that happen? Hold on a second. Can I go in here? I thought I had a jetpack. Oh, I need elements. I don't have any elements. Holy crap, a totally. That changes a lot. Now, the reason why I wanted to show you this is look at that. Hey, right, look, I'm going to go out of the. There's the edge 
of it, okay? We see this. Now I'm going to back up into it and watch what happens. <laughs> that is unbelievable. So the creatures inside of here see this and have no idea that if you did this, it converts to that. So just one step back and you're in their desert. <laughs> it's so wild. What a clever concept. Very, very clever concept. We need some more element here. All right, so this is the desert. Okay, and it is, look at the sky. Now let me get back out of it. Look at the sky. <laughs> it's different. It's pretty neat. There's, there's a lot of stuff to explore here. Lots of stuff. So let's go to the winter. And the same thing happens over there. I don't want to make this overly long. But I do want to show you what this can do. Now, for those who are watching and are not not aware of the current hardware that I have, this is a this is a uh, AMD 1950X 16 core 32 thread CPU running actually uh, two video cards, but uh, one is an RX 580, which is not used in this scenario, and I do have a GTX 1080 Ti. And if you look carefully in the lower left hand corner, you can see the frames per second I am achieving. Now we are actually at Epic. Everything is maxed out in this game to get all the visual effects that we absolutely want. And here's an entrance to a cave. I'm assuming that goes into somewhere. So we'll have to investigate that. That's pretty cool. I want to show you this. Now, things that are purple are corrupted. I'm going to lay down here. See, that's corrupted. That's corrupted Petrodon. Now, I have no idea there's any corruption in here. So now we're in winter. Now he's in winter. He followed me in. But we can't have that. That is the reason why I have a weapon. Well, that, wait a minute. Is that what I think it is? Is that the typical one? Is that, is that advantageous? Arvin yes, it is. Okay. Just checking. Okay, does he look different? Maybe because of the cold. So this is the winner. Now watch. I'll do the same thing I did. And we'll pop out. And there we go. There's the dome. We're back up into it. And the same thing happens. So they have no idea. They can't see me. It's a completely different environment. Completely different environment. I don't know if he even, even sees me. Let's see if he actually comes after me. He does. So it's pretty wild though. Just by stepping out. 
So the terrain is completely different. See? <laughs> and they drive and they're walking into nowhere land. Oh, hello. Oh, I'm actually hitting the... That is the edge. So I can't even shoot it. But I can shoot outside of it. I can't shoot into it. That's interesting. See? So there's the edge. So once I'm in, I'm in. Oh, I can't shoot out. Oh, okay. Look at that. I uh, That must have been a glitch. I probably wasn't able to do that. Maybe I was right on the edge here and I was able to shoot. Yeah, that's what it was. I was right on the right on the cusp. Alright, so so these are the two areas. Oh crap, you gotta be kidding me, really? Alright, so that's that. So let's since we are here. What is attacking me? Oh. So since we are here, let's investigate that entrance, that tunnel. We're not kill this thing here. If this goes anywhere, I have no idea. Let's see. Metal. Bears. Bear necessity. Da, 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 da. No, it doesn't go anywhere. Goes nowhere. See how these things are corrupted? It's crazy. So this is a very, very interesting map. And it is caverns and caverns and all kinds of things. So let's show you the bad area. And we'll call this an episode. Or, yeah, we'll call it an episode. So there, yes, there are dragons here. You have to go into a specific spot for them. See if we can get down into so you can see some creatures. Now oh, these are blow bait. These things actually fly. They suck in air and then they fly. They're like kind of sort of tech. Tech as well. But it is really cool to be in here. Yeah, he saw me. How can you not? Is he chasing after me? Something is. <laughs> So uh, we're still on the outskirts of, look at this thing. This thing is mean as hell, look at that. Freezes his, his prey. And which is interesting, it is a mammoth against something futuristic. So that's like kind of the reason the extinct extinct look at this thing it does it's not a dragon but it, it acts like one but it can't really fly it's a jumping creature which is wacky but uh, nonetheless it's something we don't want to deal with right now so let's go check out the bad area and call it a day well at least at least this one there's another one of those things on the outside, Sam. 
He's on the inside of that dome. So we should be pretty close to dragons now. This is like the area where they should be. Now take note of the graphics or the icons in the lower right hand corner of my screen. It is hot and I'm using food faster than normal. Okay. So we're going to drop down here. And these are all corrupted T-Rexes. Well, actually, these aren't T-Rexes. These are, what the hell are these things? There's a, there we go. There's a dragon. Oh. There they are. Hello. I knew I was going to come up to them eventually. But yes, there they are. They are here. Anything in the red. So let's crank up a little bit here. There's more. I shouldn't die because I think I have not quite invincibility on, but I can't die from these guys. Oh, there they are. Look how many they're here. Holy crap. They're all coming after me now. They can't keep they can't catch up to me. Here, let me turn around. So you can see them. <laughs> That's quite a few of them. Someone's pissed. Holy crap. Yeah, I would say so. Go the other direction. Let's blow past them. So obviously you need to be very careful when you come into this section here. And, uh, yeah, <laughs> that's all I have to say. Let's come over here. Change direction. Get up. They're coming up closer. So they can't keep up with me. I am actually faster than them. Oh, they lost interest. All right, so let's go up a little higher. I just want to show you. And yes, we will be shooting them. Get their attention. Well, they're moving very fast. Okay, let's come over here. So anywhere there's red, you'll find a dragon, a wyvern. Wyvern, I should say that. That's the use the correct name. Oh, shooting myself. Not good. I'm trying to get to his attention to fly up here. But I don't think I'm going to get that. There we go. Got one. Number 11 down. They're not that strong. Unless you happen to find a strong one. But then again, I do have an incredible gun here. So, anyway, without beating a dead horse here, this is a bad area. So try not to be here. <laughs> here they come. <laughs> Ha, ha, ha. 
Here they come. Got one. Who are they hitting? Now, granted, I would never attempt this if I didn't have what I have on right now. I just thought I'd mention that because who would come anywhere near creatures such as this on purpose? <laughs> Yeah, you fell. Uh oh. Let's get out of here. There we go. Another two. Another one. Rock Drake, that's what that is. Maybe that big thing that jumped up on me? Really? You look like you're stuck. Hello. Wow. Hold on a second. All right, so anyway, that's the bed area in red. Stay away. Awesome, awesome, awesome map. This is definitely worth... If you haven't purchased it yet, get get it. If you got it for free, congratulations. But it's awesome. Absolutely awesome. Awesome thing. <laughs> anyway, guys, if you like this video and you think it's really cool and it deserves a big thumbs up, please give me a thumbs up. Also, hit that bell for future notifications. And if you're not a subscriber, please subscribe. I've been part of that YouTube purge, the sub purge, and I lost almost 1,100 subscribers. So please put your hands together <laughs> and give me some subscribers. And the next episode, we're going to be checking out that down there. And this will be pretty cool. I'll explain to you how that works. That's an OCD, I believe, or ODS or whatever the hell it is. We're going to check it out. Take care, and we'll see you next time. Creative Labs, iRaw. Plug it in like, like this. The inside of this is really impressive. 100A in the Prius. The AC adapter, one amp charger, and it's big, and it's made out of aluminum. Okay, as you can see, the backup is complete.
like so. Now you can create the rate array. I mean, for the for the price difference between the two.